the first thing that we learned when we started diving into this is that the potential for use is very much a case-by-case -case basis. Just because I say that we can reuse infrastructure in the North Sea doesn't mean that you should take any rig or any well of any oil company that offers to you. Uh, we have to be very clear that some of the stuff will not be useful for carbon capture and storage in the future, but others will. So we need to delve deeply and make sure that the pipelines, our rigs, are in the right place and they have the right conditions for transport and storage. Uh, also, due to the heterogeneity, so the, the differences, every rig is very boutique, it's not the same everywhere, uh, and the same with wells, that it's very difficult to make an assessment of which ones will be useful for CCS. They also come with much larger liabilities. They've been in place for much longer, they have um, uh, higher liabilities that are associated with them. So we focus primarily on pipeline reuse. Uh, pipelines are much easier to assess, and for CO2 transport and storage, the cost savings are probably much higher. So we, through a simple assessment, we saw that the capex cost could easily be 70% lower in reusing a pipeline uh, that currently exists. And that also depends on how long the pipeline needs to be mothballed. So how long we have to leave the pipeline there without an active use. Uh, the reduced environmental impacts are obvious. You don't have to uh, remove a pipeline just to plant a new pipeline there a few years later. Um, also, the timing is uh, very important as well because you can reuse and get access to the storage sites more rapidly. Another thing that might be uh, exactly obvious is that when it comes to the narrative of carbon capture and storage and CO2 transport, the reuse of infrastructure becomes very important as well. Uh, so it doesn't just make the deployment of projects more, more rapid, but it also means that we can, we can show that uh, the industries and the techniques that have been used to produce carbon from the underground and to produce what is a large point of our climate change and global warming uh, challenge can actually serve as part of the solution. And it means that capital that we've invested in producing hydrocarbons can now be turned around to actually remove CO2 and to reduce CO2.